Ladies and gentlemen, in this RedGamingTech.com video, I'm going to show you how to get a Jade Empire working on, well, pretty much Steam and Windows 7. There's basically an issue where if you try to launch the game, it will come up with a configuration window, and basically what happens is from then on, the game crashes. Um, it just won't get past the configuration. The configuration itself will just um, crash. And I've tried a couple of ways to basically fix this, and the best one I've found, I'll show you in a moment. But um, I've also tried to, I'll just go back for a moment, I've tried to basically make the configuration compatible for Windows uh, XP and that kind of thing. It just doesn't work for my system. So there is a slightly better way. Um, what I'll do is I'm going to delete what I just did. So hang on, just one second, just going to scroll down. Yes, I believe it was that one. Okay. What we're going to do, however, I'm just going to rename that just so I don't have to worry about it. There we go. Uh, right. All you have to do is the following. I'm just going to quickly delete that. Yep. I'll just send it to the recycle bin. Uh, I'm just going to quickly load Notepad. It's just off the screen, but don't worry. I'm not doing anything special. All you have to do is load Notepad um, and then just go to Save As. You can make it completely blank. And then I've already got in the lo right location for myself. So you can see right there, uh, it's in the right area. So for me, that would be the drive that I'm installed it to games, Steam, which is the folder that Steam is in, Steam Apps, Common. So it's not your username, it's actually the Common, the Jade Empire or Jade Empire, and then Data. And then what you want to do is you want to type in that name. You'll, I'll put it into the description, don't worry. But you need to make sure that you've got the capital uh, S and the capital I. And you need to make sure it's .xml. If it's a text, it will not work. Okay. Then all you need to do is click on all files. So that will basically make sure that it saves it as the correct file type. And click save. And obviously there's not going to be any information there. But that's fine. That's okay. You just click uh, click the X button, and I'm just going to press end, and that'll bring us all the way down to the the bottom. And you can see right there, you've got system information .xml, and that will basically allow you to load up Jade Empire. Um, I don't know if the configuration works. I haven't actually tested that, which is a bit silly. I should have done that before the video, but nevertheless, you can get into the game. You can configure all the controls and and uh, the graphics options from within the game. At least for me, I. Um, so that's cool. So yeah, that's how you get it working on Steam slash Windows 7. Um, it's quick, it's dirty, but it works. So hopefully, for those of you who are having issues with this uh, game, it's really good, by the way. So I'd encourage you to buy it still, even if you're a bit uncertain. Um, yeah, this is basically how you fix it. So anyway, um, hopefully you guys have found the video helpful, and I'll see you around soon. Bye for now.